I call this the magic studio. You know, it just kind of sets the tone. It's the magic studio, which means anything can happen, and I hope it will. I want to see what's on the other side of the mountain. I don't know what's there, and I don't go in with with any kind of high expectations. I try to be open to all the questions. I don't know what the answers are. I'm just trying to create something that I have never seen before. And that is the best part about being an abstract painter. There's only so many colors, and yet there's new paintings coming out all the time. I love that concept. Uh, Joseph Campbell, and he talked about follow your bliss. The lights went on, follow your bliss, and ever since I've been following my bliss, which is doing abstract painting, I've been the happiest I've ever been. And I discovered by following my bliss was painting is not perfect. Get that concept of perfection out of your, your mind and you'll be doing art the way you've been given this gift to do art, which is express yourself, play with ideas. It's all about playing with ideas and have intentions and not trying to make anything that's perfect. Perfect is boring. Uh, I have these uh, little pieces of paper all over the place here. As a matter of fact, these are my permission slips. Isn't that silly? These are my permission slips. These are pieces of paper that I stick all over the walls. And I said, you know, artists, we need a permission slip too. Permission to paint the way we've always wanted to paint. And so I said, permission. And so I came up with this, if you need to ask the question, the answer is always yes. It's true. Paint as if it were your last gig. I learned that from a jazz musician, like this. It says, paint out loud. Yes! Everyone is going to look into your painting and bring their own life experience, their own culture, their own education, their own personal experience of what has happened to them and what will happen to them in their life. And if they do that, then I think my job is done. That because I want to excite other people and you help them to use their imagination to paint what you know, that's all you can do. Paint what you know, teach what you've learned, pass it on, and then love what you do. And if you could do those things together in combination, and I think you're gonna be all right.